Okay, all right, baby's up. Let the games begin. <laughs> are gonna show 24 hours with that crazy toddler. Say hi everyone! Hi! What's today gonna be like? Is it a surprise? Basically moments after I breastfeed her she wants to like jump off the bed and get going with the day. This is gonna be today. Also we have not done her room. This is why it kind of looks like a crazy hot mess. We did get up these curtains though. So that's, that's an achievement. Hey, you in your bathroom? Yeah? Oh no, she likes to take everything out Wait. of it. What's that? Should we go downstairs? Mommy left her little coffee down there. Orange. She's really into stacking things right now. Good job. Yeah. Wow, that's a pretty rainbow. So usually after she wakes up, we do a little bit of playtime before we actually have breakfast. Um, since she just got her milk, gotta watch the M word. Uh, since she just had that, we're just hanging out a little bit and then I gotta figure out what I'm making her for breakfast. Cause I don't know. Whoa. I usually offer her water as well, but it's downstairs, so we'll go get that in a sec. Hey, we still need to play the chair. Shall we go downstairs and get some water? Stick on mommy, just the, just the cup. Oh no, they do. <laughs> wow, thank you. Oh, okay. She's gone. This is gonna be a shelf for her playroom that we have to build. So I gotta keep all the doors closed because she will go into everything. We are doing easy toast and fruit today. Easy peasy. Story of my life, I make Sage like a nice nutritious breakfast and then I just like snack on whatever. I made these cookies last night. They are made out of almond flour, but I'm gonna have a cookie for breakfast because I can. Mm. I need fuel. Bye, Daddy. Yeah. Bye, Daddy. All right, Sagey, we have some scrambled eggs, toast. Strawberries, dad special. Here you go, madame. Oh, careful. I'll take unicorn kitty. I did make Sage some scrambled eggs. I feel like she hasn't had them in a while because she kind of went through a phase where she didn't want them anymore. But I thought I would try them out again. We'll see. She's probably going to go for them last. Sometimes I will just like take her fork. Uh. Okay, maybe for later. Perfect amount. Look at that. Mm. 
Best time for me to eat is while she's eating. If you watch my new mom hacks, check the video here. I mentioned that and honestly, like especially I'm by myself today with Sage. You want more? She's doing her more. Okay, I'll give you some more toast. I'm also giving her the rest of my banana from my smoothie. See if she'll have that. I tried. <laughs> I tried. Yeah, mommy tried. I'm solo parenting it today, so I gotta be strategic, and that means eating while Sage eats. I still don't know how I'm gonna get myself ready today. We'll figure that out. I'll lock her in the bathroom with me. <laughs> lock all the doors. All right, I'm gonna say that's what's gonna be left on her plate. I asked you guys on Instagram what you wanna see in today's video, and a lot of you said what doesn't get eaten. I'm gonna have it all linked down below, either in the info box or a blog post. I'm gonna try them here. We're gonna go try to get ready and I think head to the park this morning. I usually like to do an activity in the morning and then in the afternoon, especially if I'm just by myself. I feel like it's just easier to be doing something together, getting out of the house. I feel like I've always heard like, oh, when it's a rainy day, it's really hard with the toddler because you want to get out. Like being outside is the best thing for toddlers in my opinion, like she loves it. I feel like she's able to use up some energy, explore, play. It's good for both of us. Do you want to go outside? Yeah. Side? Okay, but not, wait, mommy's gonna get ready. And then I should have said the word. Cash is getting excited too. Oh, that didn't last long. Okay, I'm gonna get dressed real quick while she is occupying herself. Okay, you stay there. Hang out. She's like, I need something else now. Toddler check. She is playing with stuff she shouldn't be playing, but I'm checking on her. Yeah, you can play with those. Whoa. Whoa. There you go. Uh -oh. I definitely think one of the hardest things is to get ready with the toddler. Usually I do it when Matt's home, but I don't got that option today. And I know a lot of parents don't, so. We're just figuring it out. Thank you. What are you doing? Okay, I had to break because Cashew is barking outside because she wants to come inside. It's like having two kids, I tell you. Baby and a doggy. So let's go get Cashew and then I will somehow finish getting ready. Okay, a little shrug so mommy can finish getting ready. That's how you do it. Okay, let's get your clothes on. You wanna go outside? Come here. Let's go. Ah. Oh, head and shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head and shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. And eyes and ears and mouth and nose. And shoulders. Are we gonna get copyrighted? Stand up. One, two, three, do, 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 do. Hang on. Let's do the back button. Side. Okay, what do we need? We need sunscreen, hat, shoes, snacks, water. Okay. Okay, all right.
shoes. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna have to get the vacuum cleaner. Okay. Mom fail. I should have taken these out outside. Oh my god. Sand everywhere. Daddy's worst nightmare. Let's go wash our hands. Let's go wash our hands and get lunch. Wash, 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 wash. You want to go on the sprinkler mode? Ooh. Okay, all clean, all clean. It's over. Okay, so I'm gonna do a quick cleanup while getting her lunch together. I just when you're by yourself, I feel like it's so much harder to clean as you go especially when they're in the toddler stage because they're just like go 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 and it's hard to like you leave them alone for two seconds and then they're like jumping off of a table you know literally standing on the chair do we see this two seconds she'd be on this table oh like on the table i'm not even kidding is it nap time yet is it nap time Okay, how's that camera yeah. angle? from a new toy kit that we got. I will link all this down below and I'm also gonna link her little learning tower as well, which she's been loving. We've been doing lots of baking and cooking videos together on Instagram, so definitely follow me there. Wow. And it's all going well until it's not. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You done in there? Okay, lunch is almost done. A couple more minutes. Why are you pushing me? Okay, and Cashew's barking at me again. You guys are gonna drive me crazy. Follow the leader, 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 follow the leader. Inside, come on. That's like three times since we've been back from the park. Let's go, come on. I'm not gonna come chase you. No, mommy's cooking something right now. Okay. Okay, no more outside time. And this is how you get stuff done. You just literally have a toddler Hi. on you at all times. Okay, I didn't even show you what I'm making. I have some brown rice spaghetti pasta cooking up here and then just some Rayo's marinara sauce with some lamb meatballs that I made the other day. I just kind of mashed them up because there was only a few and I'm gonna try to eat the same thing Sage is having. So I put some extra pasta in there for me and she is all ready for food. Oh, I think, oh, mommy didn't even wash that yet from breakfast. Yeah, we gotta clean that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, arm through. Can you get your arm in? Did your belly get bigger? What the heck? Mm -hmm. Do we need to bust out some musica? Mm -hmm. I see what's happening here. You're face to face with goodness and it's strange. She's having her spaghetti and lamb meatballs. Just switching it up from our regular beef. And she, honestly, she probably will have about two more servings of this pasta. She really likes it. And it's just like a nice sensory food for her to pick up and slurp. And then she does really love strawberries. So I try to mix it with different fruits. I have some grapes. It's sometimes hit or miss with them. But at least I know she'll load up on the, the pasta and meat. You're tired, I can tell she's gonna pass out. Play hard, sleep hard, right? So I actually love this new set that I got. I'll link it down below. Um, this one suctions really good to this tray. And this cup is a really great size for toddlers because it's a little bit bigger than the tiny cup. And then this utensil, you know, it's still safe, but I feel like it's more like a regular 
silverware because it's harder plastic and she can actually like pick stuff up with it. Yeah, you know, pasta is a little tricky, huh? She's definitely at a stage now where I feel like it's just easier if we eat the same thing for lunch. Like a lot of times, like I'll make her something and then I think, oh, I could have just made myself more of that and eaten that instead of like putting her down for bed and then trying to figure out what I'm going to have for lunch. Like, or I'll just have leftovers in the fridge. I made this for her yesterday and I was like, oh, I don't want that. So today, pasta for everybody. This is not a good combo. Saucy toddler, white t-shirt. I just need a document. We're adding more. This girl can eat her pasta. Hey. She has she has friends at the park now. Say bye. 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 Yeah. Things were thrown on the floor. You want more? Oh, why are, you, why are you sticking that in your nose? No, no, no. We don't stick pasta up her nose. No. Oh, this is messy. the jar trick. Let's put your hands in there. Flash, 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 flash. Okay, this pasta idea was kind of a fail because we are messy. Where's Sage? I just saw her here. I don't know where she went. Hmm. Is she Do. Let me do it first. Fresh, fresh. Okay, you do it now. Okay, more water. Brush, brush, brush. Brush your teeth. Brush, brush, brush. I love you when the wind is still. Normally, Matt puts her down for her first nap, but I find if I'm the one who does it, she'll ask for milk. And I am trying to wing down to just doing three times a day. Um, but I mean, it's hard when she's asking, especially because it's like obviously a comfort thing, for, like before bed. So I, I like to feed her when she wakes up instead. Yeah. But like I said, if it's just me at home with her, usually she'll ask and yeah, it just like breaks my heart. So. Just a little milky before you go to bed. It's not even 12.30. <laughs> Feels like a day. And she's down. Or she will be in like a couple minutes. Oh my gosh, I feel like the house is a disaster. I was gonna like maybe put on some makeup, but who am I kidding? I'm like, I don't, I'm gonna clean and then I'm gonna take a little relaxation on the couch because I feel like I deserve it. All right, I'm finally relaxing on the couch. I spent about 30 minutes just in the office uh, catching up on emails, catching up with the team, checking in and just organizing some like computer stuff and then now I'm just gonna relax for a bit and I find I don't do this enough I just like once Sage is in bed I just like okay go 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 do things around the house like the house is clean and you know I did what I need to do for work and like I am vlogging today so that is work as well and now I'm just gonna like chill I think I'm gonna watch a little YouTube and just relax and let my body rest um also these couches they're disappearing today and I have to somehow order new couches like ASAP. So 
These are going to an Airbnb that Matt has been working on setting up. And yeah, we're going to have no couch. I don't know how that's going to work, but that's the update. Okay. See you in a bit when Sage is up. Hello. Hi. So I checked the swim times today, and there's open swim for a little bit longer. So should we put our bathing suits on? Okay. Swimming. Put your swim diaper on. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna put my bathing suit. Oh. Okay, can I talk? No. <laughs> I'm gonna put my bathing suit on and get her bag ready, and then we're gonna go. Uh-oh. <laughs> Let's go. Careful. Oh. Alright, packing some snacks for after swim. There we go. Do you want some water? Sage, water? Ready for swim? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Getting heavier and heavier every day. <sighs> it's always sad time when we don't swim. You did so good, Sage. Okay, time to go home. Can I have a snack? hair looks like a rat's nest um i can't really go upstairs and brush it because uh i got sage and no one else here so uh, we're just gonna go with it hopefully it dries and i get like cute beach waves probably not but you know <laughs> you want snacks i'm not gonna lie i was gonna make a really cute recipe together for snack time i was gonna make the soft baked peanut butter coconut cookies from the baby health nut cookbook show a photo of them here they're so good but honestly i'm like so tired Today is not a typical day. Like sunshine and park all morning, water in the afternoon. I just wanted to soak up some time with Sage. Sagey snack. And I feel like mission accomplished, but I'm just like so tired. I think snacks and Shrek is the way to go. Although we have no couches right now because like I told you guys earlier, they got moved and I don't even know what I'm gonna do. No couch, which just means no TV, right? Like when I said we have no couches right now, I'm not kidding. <laughs> okay, do you want to take these off? Is this the new couch, the table? Okay. Slumber party on the floor. so tired like I don't know how single parents do it usually at this point I would hand her off to Matt but he's still out and I feel like we just had a long day and now I gotta figure out what she's eating for dinner do my girls no 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 don't cl no you're not supposed to climb excuse me bum down bum down or you're out Um, okay, maybe a different toy, because if that falls down, it, it might dent the floor. Okay, let's get a different toy. Let's, let's, get, let's get a different toy. Alright, 
I've decided on just some rice, like tofu stir fried rice. And I actually do, oh, this is spilling. I do have a similar recipe in the Baby Health No Cookbook. Check it out. I'll put a link down below. And I'm just cooking up some, I'm cooking up some white rice. It usually only takes like 20 minutes. So while that's cooking, I'm gonna cut up this block of tofu, add some frozen veggies, a little seasoning, and boom, stir fry, ready to go. Uh, quick and easy, oh, no, let's not. Uh-oh, no, don't climb the counter. Oh my God, you gave mommy a heart attack. She's playing, we got music, I'm gonna get dinner ready. tofu going, some corn and edamame, and rice is cooked. Woo, it's hot. Ooh, got a little shell. Okay, so this is actually the first time that I'm serving sage edamame like whole. Usually, I've given it to her before, but blended up in a hummus. So there's a really great app called Solid Starts. You can search any food and search up how to serve and it'll tell you because I'm like, oh, I'm because I was just wondering if it's good to do whole or if I need to mash it, but it says 18 months plus it's fine to do whole. Okay, so we're good. I just wanted to double check, but it's a great free app. Highly recommend it. They have an Instagram account too. Letting Sage play a little bit, and then Matt's actually gonna put her to bed. <laughs> Everybody misses da their daddy today. questions about how I've kind of navigated like cashew with sage and honestly we just started like right from the beginning I'm more so worried about sage hurting cashew than cashew hurting sage although like if cashew's playing or running I'm definitely mindful that like she may knock sage over so I just kind of avoid that situation and then sage I always just from the very beginning have said nice yes. yeah an open hand and she's just really gentle with cashew they have their own relationship. Yeah, Ashley smacks her. Yeah. Oh, that's just like a light pet. Yeah, no, they're really good together. And Cash has been around a lot of kids. <laughs> okay, lie down. Oh, okay, sorry to disturb you. <coughs> sorry to disturb you. Lie, lie back down. No, okay. Okay. Who wants to see 24 hours with the dog? Give me the hat. Mm. <laughs> okay, we are going to read Alice's Adventures in Wonderland toned down version. Okay. This is Alice. She tumbles down, down, down the rabbit hole. A mad hatter and a tiny little dormouse. Alice follows an army of playing cards. Okay. All right, I'm actually gonna do the outro in our guest room. Good job, Matt. Good job. <laughs> Made it through another day. Uh, so Sage is actually on a really good sleep routine. If you guys have not watched, I actually have two videos on baby and sleep and what we do i'll link it here basically she will sleep now throughout the night so um if there is any random in the middle of the night wake-ups i will document it but 
Um, she's pretty good at sleeping throughout the night now, which is so nice because if there's anything I wish I could go back and tell my new mom self is that just every phase is so different and you know even the hard ones like they do pass and you will get sleep again i want to point out that although you know sage and i had a really fun day like at the park we went swimming she ate all this delicious food you know not every day is like that some days there's a lot of shrek on the tv um there's just you know doing what we can with food and what we have in the fridge you know no fancy pasta and stir fries and you know, and that's okay. It's, you know, I don't want you to think that this is like the expectations of what you should be doing with your toddler. This is just like, I want to have a really fun day with Sage today because I didn't have too much like computer work to do and I kind of cleared my schedule, wanted to vlog for you guys and just spend some one-on-one -on -one time with Sage and that's what I did and I documented it, but I don't want you guys to think that every single day we're doing those things and I mean, she may go to the park and swim in the afternoon, but like it's split up. You know, like if Matt takes her to the park in the morning, I do, I might do swim in the afternoon, like we split things up and yeah, anyways, I just wanted to point that out and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have not watched, I've done a few of these. I've done like a 24 hours with a newborn, 24 hours with the six month old eating, starting solids, and I think another one for uh, crawling. So this is like the toddler walking, talking, all the things edition. And I'm gonna have a whole blog post down below linking any products that I mentioned in this video and just going into more detail on certain things that we do and um, just kind of what our day looks like. I know these videos are helpful for new parents or even if it's like your second or your third, um, I just find them helpful and it's also fun for me to look back on. Um, there are things that have changed and also things that have stayed the same and it's just really nice to kind of look back and compare in a non-judgmental way. So I hope this video was helpful to you and inspiring and just gave you some ideas that you can do with your little ones. And also just to know that, yes, yeah, Sage throws her food on the floor. She has big feelings. She's a toddler and every day is kind of crazy and it's also really fun and cute. And I'm just really enjoying the stage that she's in because I just feel like there's more like two-way communication and she's just like super cute. It, she's exhausting, but like really, really cute. And I'm just like soaking up these days. Although there's many future phases to look forward to, I know once this one passes, it's, it's passed, you know, so. Um, thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Share it with a mom, a dad that may find this helpful. Maybe they have a one and a half year old right now. Um, but I hope you guys have an amazing day. Subscribe. I post here every single week and I will see you in the next one. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but I hope you guys liked it. Okay. Mwah.